What is up guys, Matt from School Busters and today we're talking about the PlayStation 5. Yes, Sony has released their official uh, time of uh, month when they are going to release the PS5, which is the Christmas holidays or December 2020. So the PlayStation 5 will be super quick at loading up games. You won't have to wait around for like a few seconds. It's even quicker than that. Uh, it's got UI, so you can partially download a game. So either if you just play the campaign of the game, or if you just want to play the multiplayer aspect of the game, you don't have to download the full game, which is I think is a, a brilliant idea. The next one is obviously, we all know, it's going to have backwards compatibility. So the PlayStation 4 games will be able to play on the PS5. The new PlayStation 5 controller has two new features to the controller. This is haptic feedback and this is going to be replacing the rumble or the main vibration of the pad so this is going to give us a weird sensation in the game either it, just for an example if we're playing driving games and you're using the controller if you was to hit a wall this will feel different for you to be getting shot in a shooter player game so the sensation of the controller is going to be completely different to completely different games the next one is adaptive triggers. So R2 and L2, as you all know, will be changed or reworked slightly. So the feedback from them will be a bit different in shooter games and like a bow and arrow instead. So like placement in Minecraft, stuff like this. It'll be like the pad itself with these new features will just feel completely different to the original DualShock uh, 4, which is the PS4 one. Uh, I think that's a good, a good pad. Now for the potential games. So obviously we know the returning games of PES, FIFA and COD. They'll be coming back because they come out every single year at the probably near identical at the same time cod whatever it's going to be pest 21 and fifa 21 for the potential games that could be coming out with the ps4 sorry ps5 that's a correction it's gta 6 this won't be an exclusive this because obviously uh, gta 6 has been in the works for ages We've got Gran Turismo 7. This is a Sony exclusive game, a racing game that I do enjoy playing, but I've not played it in time. So I reckon that will be coming out. You've got Battlefield 6 could be returning. You've got Batman, Arkham Batman. I don't know which one it will be. Uh, if it's a prequel to all the other ones or is if it's the one after the Dark Knight one. So give us your thoughts in, in the comments below. Thank you for tuning in. Stay tuned for more and I'll see you all soon. Adios.